still the city. Hello. <laughs> it's two of you anyway. How's yes, two of us. We're good, thank you. How are you? I'm fine. It's fine out here in the sunshine. It's nice. It's lovely. Are so you open today? We did. We did. It was fantastic. Even though we started at 11 o'clock yeah. uh, this morning, the crowd was lively. Um, Can't believe it. <laughs> <laughs> Are those without hangovers? Anyway. No, I saw the ones even with hangovers. They, uh, they, they put a good innings in. So, <laughs> it was a great response to say it was a bucket bottle. Yeah, a great response, yeah. Right. Couldn't ask for much more. And the rain held off. The rain held off. Yeah. Well, let's get in and, here. Uh, James, the guitar's wet. <laughs> you're relatively new to the band? Yeah, October last year. Yeah, October. When, when, when you asked for the yeah. We did. We did, <laughs> and we won't go anywhere else, will we? Pal? <laughs> uh, no, how did you get? You know, how did you resist the change? Well, it's mainly through. It, it was through Smith. Yeah, at first, but I've known him for years. Yeah. Uh, I answered the call. Yeah, the opportunity came. We wanted to take this really seriously. Like we want to give this hundred and ten percent. And uh, me yeah, we got him in. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, he's one of the main driving forces for us. To be fair, so. As well as bringing something new to the table, expanding our sound a lot more, and uh, quite, quite got a, a good hand at uh, producing as well. So we've got him uh, helping out, obviously producing the next release for us, basically. Some of the influence in the Steel City pop. That's it. <laughs> and you write as well. Yeah, yeah, we we, uh, we write and we. We do our own stuff now. Yeah, that's uh, it. Which is great. It's very efficient for us because it works around when we're free. Yeah. Uh, it's also a lot cheaper. It is. Yeah. We work. We all work nine to five jobs basically. But we've got our own studio which we rehearse, and um, whenever we've got any spare time, we'll we'll write. We can record, do all those demos and all that kind of stuff. Uh, originally, before James was in the band, we were attempting to record the stuff ourselves, uh, but there was a piece missing. Like, we're not very knowledgeable about recording everything, but luckily James had experience with this, and basically came over, took the reins, oh, you need to do it this way and this way, and it's just blown everything out of the water. It's brilliant. I think we're just excited for everyone to hear what we've got coming. Yeah, out yeah. That. That's the... So, I'm excited. <laughs> What was it, the new album? It'll be uh, an EP this year. Oh, okay. uh, and um, Call of the Wild have had the exclusive on stage. said so the next single is going to be Bulletproof. Uh, we've worked hard on these songs and we've already got the, uh, the videos recorded. Everything's ready to go. Uh, we're just waiting for management and PR to get us a nice little battle plan together because we want to do this properly. Because the, the single before, we kind of did it ourselves because we wanted to, it was more of a statement to say that we're here, we're alive and kicking, because the last release we did was 2018, so it's quite a long way away. So we basically wanted to put the first single out, Supremacy, uh, and just said that we're, we're here, we're, we're back, we're a band, you're going to get new music out of us, and now that we've done it that way, we want to do everything else properly, to say, right, now let's give it, let's give it some, let's take it. I can tell the difference this morning when you were Thank you. Yeah, with that energy. Yeah. Thank you very much. Very sharp, excited. Yeah. We are, we're excited. excited. <laughs> we've, got, we've got a lot of things in the pipeline and, and, and going out and, and I don't know, you've just got this, this passion. For it. We've all got passion, right? That's why we do it. But when you've got something that we're proud of, we can't wait to release, it's just, it's, it's nice to sit on it for yeah. a while and work with battle plan and, and then release it and then hopefully we'll get a good response. Yeah, it's nice to have been so far, kind of like out of the game a little bit, especially with new music, not, not as much gigging. But it's nice to see that the amount of support we're actually getting to carry on doing what we're doing. It really does spur you on. When did you first start? First get together? When did How long have you been together? Still the City have been together since the end of 2014. And that, that was when we were a five piece. That were that was when we literally only just barely learned how to play our instruments. We just wanted to be in a band that much. And uh, the lineups obviously drastically changed over the course of uh, six or seven years. Uh, but now we've got the lineup that we're happy with. We've all got the same motives, but obviously 
going back to oh, working. That experience. With, yeah, that's it. Like we, we all know what we want. Uh, we all divvy up the jobs, kind of thing. So James will take over the recording aspect of it. I'll take over like the social media and talking with, with people. Uh, Smith's doing uh, all the uh, video aspect of it, so any video editing or anything like that, he's going to be taking charge of that. And Ellis is basically an all-rounder, <laughs> our drummer, so he will nitpick at absolutely everything and if there's any help that we need, he will take that off our hands. It's so, good because we all get that, we're all deep in what we do. Yeah. So if I'm, if I'm sat there mixing for a good few hours, I'm, you know, I'm, I'm tunnel vision with it. So to get... Ellis and, and, and you as well uh, to come in and go actually that, that bit sounds crap. Yeah. It's good to have fresh ears, it's good to have an overall, you know, yeah. presence. Yeah, right. so did it at college or anything? Yeah, yeah, I studied at college and I did a degree in music production. So it's, uh, it's, it's something that I've always been interested in. Uh, something that's really paying off now. Definitely, yeah. Uh, but it just makes recording so much easier. You, know, you, you can. It's amazing having someone who knows what they're doing. It just sounds so much better. Like <laughs> it obviously just makes sense, doesn't it? I mean, as before, like we said, like we we tried doing it ourselves, and now that we've got someone who actually knows what we're doing, it makes so much of a difference. It's, it's it helps, brilliant. It helps the writing process as well. Yeah, it spurs everyone on to be better than what they can be, kind of thing. So everything's just going strength to strength, and we're we're excited to show everyone the. The workings of it, basically, yeah. fruits of our labour. We're, we're well, ready to I'd show like people. To, yeah, I'd just like to reiterate that this morning that was really, I could tell the difference. Thank you very much. Yeah. Let's talk some about see some of these tattoos while we're. Here. <laughs> <So>. <laughs> no, no. I can see the next up I mean, he, He's here. he's I just had know. a new one done. Oh, oh just, right, come on, let's have a look. Oh, <laughs> wow. no, that was done last night. Oh, really? Uh, this morning, I almost had a really heavy guitar strapped on my foot. Uh, to which is this is rather painful and quite hot actually. It's, it's hot to the touch. You've got the V-neck and you've got that like, eagle's head. So, oh my god. All most of it were done. Quite a lot of it were done yesterday. He says he never usually wears vests, but now is the time that he yeah, doesn't wear a never vest. Won. <laughs> <laughs> meet, meet Jeff with a with a, 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 a G E. Yeah. yeah. Oh, that's my that's my Jeff. <laughs> Get the old trap thing. And the Ned Zeppelin. Oh, yeah. Yeah. They're, they're all on there. Motley Crue, Guns N' Roses, Ramstein, Skinner, Motorhead, Zeppelin. I've got Beatles hiding under here. Oh. I've got Falls and Prison Blues by Johnny Cash. I've got Mer Like It on my wrist. It's, it's uh, yeah. Can I'm you tell he likes music? Walking, 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 walking yeah. comic book. <laughs> just love music, don't you, fam? That's how I like your um, the the saws. It, the, Fun, the only reason I'm wearing these is because I did have some white ones and usually I clean them in the shower and uh, I drop them and they're down in the plug hole. <laughs> so I've had to put these in. <laughs> these are the only ones. And it's because they're like, like little steel wheels. They're, they're really sharp, like th this. Like I end up cutting my fingers to bits trying to get them off because they're that tight. You do that, you're a guitar player. I know, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, my guitar didn't work for half a set anyway, so it doesn't really matter. But it's all good. <laughs> yeah, when that started something new, because we've never done a guitar bass with you solely singing. Yeah. So that's something we need to. I enjoyed it. It was different, a bit weird. That's it. But yeah. So as soon as my guitar stopped working on the last song. Oh yeah, I noticed. I just yeah. dropped everything out. Like, so this isn't working. I'm I'm not gonna carry on with it. I'll just drop it down. I'll just have the mic, which I've never done before. Massively out of the my thing comfort is, zone. The thing but is, is when that happened, I saw a few members in the crowd that I've seen as many a time. They kind of came alive a bit. They're like, "Oh, but we have no yeah, that's it. <laughs> like, what's going on?" In fact, the rest of the band were like, "What's going on? I've never seen this before." No, that's it. You uh, carried but, it off really well. But it, 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 it <laughs> I'm glad it made it look like I knew what I was yes, doing. It, yes, it was <laughs> I'm glad you started. Yeah, very professional. Start. <laughs> That's all right. Then. Sorted. Very professional. So what's up next for you then? Any more good times at next? Next, we've got uh, Purgatory Festival, yeah. which is at the County Music Bar. Yeah. 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 Uh, we've also got Sav Fest coming up as well. Steel Pause. Steel Pause in October, yeah. That's a local one for you, is it? Yeah, yeah, that's uh, in Sheffield, Sheffield for us. Yeah. Uh, Steel Pause. We've got Hard Rock Hell in, uh, is it November? Great Yarmouth? Fifth of November. Yeah, it's somewhere around there. Yeah, something like that. But <laughs> we haven't got times disclosed just yet. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, we're, we're keeping busy, but hopefully by the time these next gigs roll around, we'll have some music content out there, because that's the one thing that we're, I'd, I'd say lacking. We, we've got it, we've just not released it yet. But. I'd say that Steel City is a, is a brand, is a, is a, is a band. Yeah. <laughs> before even I joined. 
And then when I did, it was like the band's been on a hiatus. They've been on a hiatus. Yeah, they've been doing little bits. And now things are starting to circulate. We're starting to get that passion. We're starting to get that, that mega drive. We're getting the hunger again. Uh, it started the ball rolling. We've only got songs that we're going to be releasing very soon. We've already started recording more. Yeah. <laughs> We ain't stopping. Brilliant. I think We're your fans stopping. are going to be really excited about it because I'm those who have a well. just seen you. Just, yeah, but <laughs> this I is recommend just the beginning. Yeah, it's going to be brilliant and they catch you live soon. I can't yeah. wait. There's more shows. More, more shows. shows. More shows. <laughs> more shows. More shows. More music. Brilliant. More everything. <laughs> right, sun's coming out. Let's go and get a drink and chill out. Yeah? Thank you very much. Thank, thank you very much. much. Talk to Rock Media. Cheers.